Welcome back, everyone, to the next installment of Chrono Trigger. Things went down. We're back in the past, and we didn't choose to go there this time. Magus may or may not be in the past. I don't know. And a village burned down, you could see it, to the southwest. So we're going to go to a dactyl nest, because we need a dactyl. Or at least Isla does, but we're going to help. A cave ape and a schist? I should probably throw these rocks before it does. I forgot that that's how that worked. So this is what happens if they don't die in one, huh? Frickin' yikes. Could we maybe not? After all my upgrades, I still need to work this hard to fight these guys. Okay, so watch out for those guys. <sighs> oh wait, they're above me, it doesn't matter. Curious. Avian Rex. Alright, they're not too strong. Ah, oh, that hurt. Goodbye. Weird, but we got him. Mid ether, I'll definitely take that. I love this music. Well, you know what to do. If I could get a crit, that'd be neato. Good. Fewer volcanic eruptions, please. I should really hurry up before they erupt. But oh well, too late now. Well, I lucked out that time. Chrono leveled up, Frog leveled up, this is great. Everybody's leveling up. That's pretty good. A mid potion. A weird roundabout path, but we got it. I don't like these guys. Oh, I have to make it past them? Ugh, alright. Let's get the rock. Good, no throwing rocks, please. Ow. This cave ape. Annoying. Now the only thing they can throw is us. Or not, they're done. I just don't like dealing with those guys. Maro leveled up, this is good, this is good. Otherwise, nothing else to observe here, so I'll climb. There we go. Can I just get this? Ooh, Mesozoic Mail. It's better than what I have. Anyone can wear it, but the mist robe is better. Guess I'll give it a chrono. I'll just fight the damn rocks. 
Oh, what? I did not want the ape to show up. That's cheating. Bonk. Nice shot. Good. Again, nice shot. Don't have to let that hold me back anymore. Got caught in the chest. Oh no, I was stopped by these weird avian rexes. Resses? It's fine. Goodbye, that one was free. Alright, we're done. Oh, wow. What's the sparkle over there? Doing map stuff, sorry. Chrono! You better not even think about going without us. No, Tyranno Lair danger. You know come, maybe I'll die. If it's that dangerous, we definitely can't let you go alone. You've done a lot for us, Isla. Now it's payback time. Right, Chrono? Isla have good friend. Come on, Isla, let's go to the Tyranno Lair. Oh man, what? Oh, who's it gonna be? Well, I'm sticking with the usual, again. Oh, hello. I like that it shows the third dactyl, but not who's on it. And again, even the animated scene showed that sparkle. Oh, are you kidding me? I have full control. That's ridiculous. Freaking excellent. Well, I guess where I'm going. Hmm. Can I land wherever I want? Okay. I think I have to get back on the dactyl. That's cool. To the Tyranno Lair. Wow. They really hit you with that music. All right. I'll take him. Oh, it's a new purple. It's a reptite. It's a new reptite. God damn, Isla, are you kidding me? 500? He just walks up and deals 500? <laughs> you know, I'm curious. A oh, fang. Who cares? Oh, he missed. This music is nuts. Oh, I like this. This must have been mind melting to just hear on the Super Nintendo back in the day. This is too good. 
Alright. Okay, only one way to go. Down. There's some guys in here. I guess they're hostages. Jeez. Isla shows us how it's done. potions. They have buttons, they have technology here. Alright, we freed some hostages, I suppose. Also, you know what? I'll give someone besides Marl a chance until I get to the boss. That's probably what I'm gonna do. I gotta give Luca a chance, man. And Robo. Like, I've really been sleeping on Robo. Anyway. And Robo's under level besides. But so is Luca, so you know, whatever. Nice shot. Get out of here. Flame kick. Yeah, get those dual techs in there while we can. Turnkey, we're about to have a feast, and you're about to be the roast beast. <laughs> it's the apes! Let's go. Flame kick, huh? Strike enemy with fire kick, makes sense. That's a lot of damage. Ow. Ow. I gotta get Robo in here as well. Get all the dual techs. Whatever this feast is gonna be, you guys are missing it. Actually, I should also get Frog in here. He's got a lot of uh, tech points. So he's probably just waiting for a dual tech with Isla. I'll actually do that for just a second. All right. Yeah, there's a guy. Is that who I think it is? Can I press the thing, please? I'm trying. Isla it is Kino. Kino move back. Isla, save Kino. That is pretty good. Oh, you could just go in? Hmm. Kino, sorry. All Kino's fault. It okay. Kino, take all our of a person. Run. What'd Isla do? Strong live, weak die. Isla go be strong. Kino go too. Kino no come. Isla die, Kino new yoka chief. Isla. Damn. Isla strong, no lose. Kino no. Kino show you something. Follow Kino. I will, but you might have noticed something. That's a chest, and I have mid ether. I guess I can't go in that cell, but it might not matter. Oh, you strong Kino weak. Kino jealous. Yeah, but he just opened that thing like it was nothing. How did he do that? Huh. Oh, hello. Oh, wait, this is the guy I needed to hit with lightning. I just wasted my attacks then. Chrono should have uh, used lightning first. Whoops. 
and as a counter move. Uh, that really hurt. I actually need to heal now. Anyway, let's finish this guy. Still alive. Oh, this is a pterosaur. It's the next level of dinosaur. Slurp kiss and bubble burst. So what does that mean? Slurp kiss might be an attack. Well, I, I will heal. God, that's good. I guess I'll do it again just for Chrono. I'll try both of these things. Slurp Kiss. Heal all allies and restore status. I should have done that first. I forgot, I was thinking Charm, but Kiss is the heal move. So it's basically Aura World, but with two different characters. That's pretty cool. I'll just kill this guy real quick. Alright, now for Bubble Burst which is probably not a chrono thing. <laughs> Drop Isla on an enemy. Wow, he just brings her over there. Belly flop for massive damage. Aerial strike, lightning rod, are you serious? I was gonna swap frog out, but I can't do that now. Oh, that would have taken out the enemies, too. I could have cheated. Anyway. I'm outside. Ugh, go away, dude. Lightning Rod, Skewer Foe, and Hit with Lightning. Oh, that's sick. That is absurd damage. You calm down with that, buddy. Aerial Strike. Very nice. Okay, now I'll swap out Frog. A lot of tech points, though. Robo. We have been sleeping on Robo's abilities, so we'll see what we get here. Uh, uh, more? Immediately? Ugh, it's just the same thing. Kind of. It's not Volcano, but just go away. These Reptites. Bonk. There's the crate. Haha, -ha, Cyclone Sweep. I can't even go left. Oh, hello. Hi, Potion. And I'm going to go ahead and do this. Oh no! Ah! This is how you get into that cell where I save the prisoners. Whoops. But they let me out, so it's not so bad. A minor inconvenience. Oh, but these guys are here? Let's not. I really just don't want to do that. Now I'll go this way. More reptites. So who learned what? It's gotta be a robo move, right? Cyclone sweep. Spin chrono through enemies. Is there a reason I can't select this? Why the hell can't I select this? I'm gonna just hit something. 
I'm tired of getting wombo comboed. I need to kill these guys. I don't know what Robo's problem is here. Is it because I already attacked? Is that my problem? But why, though? Why can't I select it? What is the problem? Do I have to be standing next to Robo? I don't get what the problem is. That's really weird. And now I need the heal. It's decent healing. Another fight? Yep. Maybe I could try it again. I don't know what the problem was. Is it really just the one guy? Baffling, but all right. There it is. Oh my god, that's awesome. It's quick, but that's great. Thanks, Robo. Uh, I'll put Luca back in the party. I can't swap out Isla or Chrono or anything, so I can't find more crazy combinations. It's gonna have to be this kind of stuff. Okay, this room is going to be annoying. I got sent somewhere. Oh, is that just a fight? Lightning on the pterosaur. Ow. I gotta stop this guy from doing something. That's gonna get annoying real fast. Good thing Isla is heavily resistant, it seems. Ugh. That pterosaur... Oh, wait. No, he's still stunned, I think. And he... The, the volcano guy hurt the pterosaur, I guess? But this guy has lots of HP, so I gotta be careful. Glad that's over. Chrono, Isla leveled up. Good. Alright, so that's the fight, I guess. I'm gonna have to navigate this in a weird way. This is gonna be kind of annoying. Because there are tiles that will teleport me. And let's do... Let's do this. Here. There. I have been teleported. I have Athenian water. That's decent. How do I get that chest? I think I could just go around for it? No, I really can't. No, maybe I can, I'll try it. Uh, a regular potion, that's fine. Too bad the other chests in this dungeon are, or the room are the ones that I actually want. I think I'm allowed to go this way. Triceratopper. I'm not even sure what that is. Okay, it's a hat because it's topper. I guess I'll give it to Isla. Uh, actually, no, wait, Luca? No, Isla. A stout helm adorned with dinosaur horns. Nice. And there should be one more chest around here. Oh, I see where I need to go. That'll be slightly disorienting. Uh, let's go back to start and go here again and now go here and now I, I'm at the chest Mesozoic mail again weird ass freaking room alright who's wearing this Isla why not cause I mean I don't have it anymore for Luca to even try but I think her mist robe was better anyway so I've cleared the room now I just want to find the exit Let's do this. And I assume this is good. Yeah, we're out. Nope, we got a fight. How the hell did that thing carry that other thing?
There you go. I'm being careful with uh, whom I attack or target, whatever. Because this guy just dunks me. I'm glad that finished it because now I need to lay into this thing. Thank goodness they get stunned for so long. Get out of here. No kidding. Well, these guys are weak. I can take them without tricks. Amazing that they could just lift a pterosaur, though. Like, it's nothing. Lift a human, sure. But a pterosaur? Really? That's not scary at all. Oh wait, there are switches. All right, so both of these will open the mouth. The left one also gives me enemies. Oh no. Ugh. Yeah, the right one would have opened the mouth and given me no enemies, but I'm feeling dangerous right now. There we go. 11 tech points. There. Not that they did anything new, but we're good. This looks important. I pressed something. Oh, it opened that middle door. That's the gimmick. Okay. So one, maybe two more fights for the road. Alright, let's do this thing. Oh, very nice. Saves me a little time. In we go. Uh, all right, well, <laughs> not a problem. These lousy volcano knights, volcano knights. Oh no, it healed them? That was not what I'd hoped to do. Well, now I know. Just punch them. <laughs> I don't know if they're immune to all magic, but, uh,. I'm not going to experiment. There we go, get lost. Mar leveled up just in time. Hi. Looking for Azala? She's just through here. So, uh... Our, all right. He's just gonna let us go, so I'm gonna shelter. Works for me, I can't complain. I didn't even notice this episode is called Unnatural Selection. Alright, let's go. Oh, really? He decided he's not going to let us through after all. Now we're trapped in here. Hold it. When I said she's through here, I meant you gotta get through me first. What do you think I was flexing my muscles and looking all intimidated for? That's pretty funny. Ouch. Haha, -ha, I got third eye again, baby. I'm gonna let Kronos sit. 
Ow. Marl's gonna be the healer once she's done hasting my party. And now these guys... The gimmick here's a little different. I'm only allowed to use lightning on him. Before I used lightning to set him up and then I hit him with physical, now that's not gonna work. Physical is just not happening, so Thunder Chomp for days. That is a lot of damage. It's a good thing I have this move, it's very convenient. I mean, they're mandatory party members, so I guess they knew. But it's either this, or just have Chrono cast lightning all day. And I keep lowering his uh, defense more and more. There's the discharge, but whatever. I'm gonna need to cast uh, Cure again, though. He got his defense back, but a little too little too late, buddy. I really hope this doesn't kill. No, it won't. That does hurt, though. What a move. Like this, maybe one more hit. Ow. It's fine. This this is probably it. Yeah, get out of here. <laughs> His spell to get out of here. Hooray! Got him. Shelter again, I guess. And I'll save again. Alright, let's finish this. Seriously? Seriously? Don't even do this right now. Thank you. Go away. I'm trying to set up for something cool here. Stop bothering me. I can go to the right, but you think I need to go up the center, right? This time, I'm not gonna bother messing around. If I press the right switch, I get two pterosaurs. Not in the mood, so, uh... There. Man, that's cool. Can I go in? Thank you. Hi, Ether. Dude, come on. Boy, am I lucky he just let me have- Oh, no, he didn't. Alright. And that actually hurt, too. I was slow, what can I say? Oh, that's bad. I don't like to use more tech points, but desperate times. 
I'll take a crit, yeah. Beautiful. See ya. Oh, he's peeled? Did something happen? Oh, it was Marl, I guess. Alright. Yeah, now we're building up, right? Look at this room. Look who's here. At last, the final confrontation! It was but a matter of time. Will it be we reptites who inherit the Earth? Or you soft skin apes? Strong live, weak die. Isla just fight. Oh boy. Yikes. Hear that lovely voice? You'll soon be hearing more of it than you'd ever wish. That's not scary at all. Anyway, the chests. Triceratopper, I'm using this. Does Marl even need it? Yes. Mid ether, I'll take it. Damn, you hear that? Excuse me? Damnable red star. Yeah, they're addressing it. Fall, why don't you? Stain the earth red. Even should it prove our fate to die, we will not relinquish this world to the likes of you. This black Tyranna will have the honor of wiping you filthy apes from existence forever. <laughs> Jeez. Oh boy. All in, baby. Aha. Everybody is healing. That's that's everybody's job now. Because Black Tyranno stings. Psychokinesis! What? Careful. Ouch. <laughs> what the hell? That hurt. Marl is on haste duty, and then she'll be on heal duty. And Isla probably will too, to be perfectly honest. Strength capsule! Alright, everybody's healing from now on, except for Chrono. <laughs> I can't see the damage I'm doing, unfortunately. I forgot the button to uh, make it so I could swap the uh, the boxes. Marl was not healed nearly enough. But now everyone's fast, and Chrono can raise. So if it comes to that, that's what I'm doing. I'll leave Marl open for uh, anyone else. Oh, Isla's being transported. This is how this fight's gonna be. Just everybody's gotta heal, because two targets are scary. And the reason I'm not going for the Black Tyranno, by the way, is it'll be able to heal itself until I get rid of Azela, and I don't feel like doing with that. That's a lot of healing. I'll save something other than Cure next time. Marl could save some uh, tech points. 
Yeah, look at a lot of healing. She doesn't need that. Sleep. Oh, you are not doing that. I love that the Tyranno uses like a slurp attack. It's so goofy. Again, the others are on standby. They're just healing. Azella's Wrath, Sap. Oh, I think I... Okay, I got Azella. So you know what I'm doing now? Five. That's not scary at all. Four. That's very intimidating. And this guy's got HP to burn, too, so I gotta really hope this works. Oh, I did a thousand, though. Three. Once I get to one, I'm probably gonna just leave Chrono all open and have Marl use a Aura Whirl. This is gonna be scary. Like, genuinely frightening. But this is a good setup, right? Doing a thousand every time. Two. Uh, I'm gonna save it. I'm gonna get Aura World ready. <laughs> Zero. <laughs> that's enough, dude. Yeah, that stings. This is where Frog might have been nice, because uh, he can heal everybody. But we got our HP back. I think I pretty much have this. That did less damage, though. I don't like that. Four sixty eight. What happened? Did he defense up or what? Marla's curing herself, and he just uh, healed himself with that move too. Annoying. Nine hundred three. Damn. You think I got him? I gotta bring this guy down. I need to do more damage. Why am I doing like four hundred now? What happened to our thousand? Do you think I should just attack? 100? I don't know, man. Yeah, we're, we're doing Thunder Chomp. Although, it did say it's lowering defense and storing power, so I guess I already would have done this much damage. Yeah, now I'm doing a thousand because he's actively dropping his block. I'll probably kill him before he does his super move again. Thank you, Haste from Marl. Because I already did like four or five thousand to him before he hit us the first time, so we gotta be nearly done. Four. I love that effect. It's so intimidating. I think I need to recast Haste, honestly. But I, I still think I have this in the bag. Are you serious? How tough is this guy? This has to be it.
Okay, there it is. Chrono, Isla leveled up. Damn. We're just gonna let her go? No, it can't be! Could the heavens truly have sided with the apes? Listen, primates, and let it be known for all time. We reptites fought proudly to the bitter end. Isla, no. Huh? The Red Star? It is 65 million years ago. Like, are we all dead? <laughs> First, a great fiery stone will crash to the earth. Its flames will soon spread to scorch every corner of the land. Then the chill will begin to creep across the blackened plains, ushering in a long, cruel age of ice and snow. <laughs> a fitting end to our age, indeed. <laughs> Lavos. Even Isla knows? That's terrifying. What? He's that old. Is Lavos the star? Oh my god, he is. Lavos is from space? Isla people word. La mean fire. Vos mean big. Isla! Kino! Hurry! Lavos fall soon! All ride dactyl! Kino, hurry! Isla, what you do? Come, Azala, come! No, this is the will of the Earth. Isla, hurry! Azala, Isla, not forget. Take... Take? What take? Take care of this world. So Lavos fell to the earth in this era. And he's just been sleeping for 65 million years. Lavos, huge! Chrono, fight that? Chrono, we go place Lavos fall! I like that we're little dots. He just arrived here. We might still be able to do something. Let's go see. So that means Lavos destroyed the Earth twice. That's absurd. Here we are. We're about to start what I think is probably going to be another arc. So I'm going to go ahead and save now. We're still in 65 million BC, but things aren't looking so hot. The Tyranno dungeon is no longer there. Something is. But for now, it is time to stop the installment. Well, we certainly made a lot of progress today, didn't we? We took the fight to the Reptites and we beat them, but did it really matter? It turns out that we were at the time right before the extinction of the dinosaurs. And what caused the extinction? It was Lavos the entire time. He was an alien hurtling through space, and he hit Earth. This means that even if we go back, as far back as this game allows us to, 65 million years ago, Lavos is still around. We cannot prevent his coming, although I honestly 
don't know what possibly could have even if we did have time. But maybe we could take him out before he really gets going? We gotta do something. Until next time, everyone.